on this episode of Mainline Valve Cleaning with the Rolling Back. So this mainline valve was packed with three feet of mud, sludge, and stone. We started with the aluminum head on this unit. These guys have tried to use their clamshells in these, and quite often the clamshells don't get everything out that they can because if there's water involved, it rolls right out of the clamshells. So they stuck the rolling back in there. Using the 20-foot section line, inch and a half hose, we had this valve box cleaned out down to the valve in less than 10 minutes on our first try. Here they thought they were pretty close, so they added some water, let it sit for a minute. Went with the PVC, got a little tighter around the, the nut on the valve. Got a little rock down in there where they got out. Went back in with a little bit more water, cleaned it out, and came out pretty nice. You'll see here, you can get right on the valve, you can listen to it or get your wrench back on it. Nice and clean. Ready to roll. This next valve was only filled with water and we cleaned it down to the valve in the main line. It was about four foot deep in the road. Just a quick suction clean out in less than two minutes it was cleaned clearly out. This one, however, already had water full of it and had about eight inches of sludge at the top of the valve. And uh, this rolling back unit pulled up. We cleaned this out in a matter of three minutes total. Knocked it out. Added some water, got it real clean. Worked out really, really well. Quick job. It took longer to open the box than it did to clean it out. Cleaning out was a breeze. Just dump the water, rinse it out, worked like a champ.